Tens of thousands of public servants from prison officers, education workers and court staff walked off the job today, warning rolling strikes will continue if their pay doesn't increase. They've rejected a 3% offer, but the Premier says there isn't any more on the table. A familiar war cry. What do we want? Pay rise! When do we want them? Now! With a familiar target. Mr Perrottet, we are coming for you. Thousands of public servants, the latest, to march on Macquarie Street. We've done our job and we get a slap in the face from Dominic Perrottet and the government. The slap, a pay rise. You weren't happy with the 3% pay offer? No. 3% next financial year, the potential for 3.5, the one after. What number would you be happy with? It should at least match inflation of 5.1. The frontline workers also furious. Health staff will get a $3,000 pandemic bonus, but they won't. We feel as though they're saying they're special and we're not. The public service is a lot bigger than just health. Outrage that echoed through the halls of parliament. <laughs> Where inside... We made a decision um, and we stand by that decision. The pair who set the pay cap played it down. This is not about pay. This is not about conditions. This is all about politics. The message from unions today is clear. Increase the pay offer in the upcoming budget or expect more scenes like this. We will stand up for our members. Uh, all the way, right from here, right through to the election. But less than two weeks out from Budget Day, the response was just as clear. Don't count on it. It would be easy for us to sit here and say and give in to the union bosses and their demands. But we don't work for the union bosses. We work for the people of our state. Amelia Brace, 7 News.